da 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 Everybody's Bob. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, everybody, this is Miles. <laughs> what was that? Whoa, whoa. Well, was that know, kind of like a kind of a Jimmy Stewart or? It's yeah. I can't. You know, I don't have all voices down. You know, as I'd like to. You know, yeah, I, do, I, I try, but I can't. I just sometimes I can't. I can't. Some, you know, I'm better than others, but yeah, whatever. Yeah, you know, I sound just like Connery, but uh, people don't get it. So, just like you sit in the locker room, like, oh, jish. <laughs> that was what you'd say in the locker room. Ah, jish. That's a weird thing to say, Mister Meesh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Was this whenever uh, the Speaker of the House was doing jock checks? Or... <laughs> that was before my time. Oh, yeah. Man. Miles went to a high school where who uh, uh, the guy became Speaker of the House for the state of Illinois. Uh, yeah. He I can't was, remember his uh, name now, but yeah. He was doing a whole bunch of stuff, uh, you know. Yeah, what's say he was there? smoking funny things, and he was trying other things. He to... was <laughs> doing jock checks yeah. on the freshman class. Yeah, yeah, that was before my time. So. Yeah, what was his name? <laughs> Dennis something? Huh? What was his name Dennis something? Dennis or? Dennis Calhoun. No, yeah, I don't Boston. remember what his name was. No. He got in trouble, though, for something. He did. Much he did. like most Illinois politicians. Uh, Yeah, pretty much. Pretty yeah, much pretty got much, in yeah. trouble. Uh, Hastert. Was it Hastert? I, I, you know, I have no comment on the matter. So Dennis Hastert, I think? I think that was his name. Anyway. I don't have no comment on the matter. I'm I not going to talk it. about it. I'm, I'm, I'm precluded from talking on the subject. I have a, a NDA on this matter because of... Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Because of uh, my orange gym shorts. And uh, anyway... Uh, I'm on the cusp of a million dollars. Yeah. So. I like to make my buddy the old-fashioned <laughs> way by... Uh, uh, being blackmailed and uh, blackmailing mm-hmm. others. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh! We we're uh, my wife. The there was all the Rocky movies were on uh, TV recently. Mm-hmm. You know, Rocky Balboa. Yeah. And my wife has fond memories of watching the Rocky movies, so we've been watching Rocky movies. So I've been brushing up on my Rocky impersonation. We used to make out at the Lincoln Theater with Taraki. Remember it? No, I didn't know her during the Rocky movies. (laughs) You'd open up the bottom. (laughs) You'd open up the bottom of the popcorn uh, box. uh, (laughs) Yeah, (laughs) honey, that wasn't me. Oh, oh, this is tequila popcorn. Get it? (laughs) Got a warm in it. (laughs) Could you do Burgess Meredith when we make love tonight? (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, unfortunately, I can't think of Burgess Meredith except as the penguin. And come on, Rock. Oh, that works just as good, too. I'm going to get him with some knockout gas, Rock. We'll get Apollo Creed. <laughs> <laughs> or he's got, like, you know, a, a umbrella with a big big, uh, pu- a big boxing glove that he punches people with. It. <laughs> hey. Yeah, unfortunately. Hey, Rock, you want to date my sister? She's retarded, man. Come on. Uh, hey. uh, come on, yeah. Oddly enough, yeah. that guy, he reminds me of you. but uh, Yeah, a little bit. 
Yeah, a little, a little Bert. bit. <laughs> Bert. Something. Bert Young. Bert, oh, yeah, I was going to say Bert Warden. Yeah, wait, you wait, can wait, say wait. Bert no, Warden. Wait, 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 be wait. wrong, but yeah. Holy smokes, Batman! Yeah, he writes, <laughs> Batman! <laughs> Rocky, look out! Sloppy <laughs> seconds, Batman. What's going on? <laughs> so, yeah, the... Um, Robin, Robin I'm going to go back to the Batcave. <laughs> yeah, but uh, the, the uh, first Rocky movie... Uh, his sister Adrian, what did seem quite uh, slow? No, didn't he say that though? Didn't he? Yeah, say something he did. Like he that? said it because she was like, you know, <laughs> kind of a wallflower dormouse kind of a yeah a character. But I mean, she was real, you know. Hey, hi, Rocky. Hi. Don't 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 tap on the glass for the fish, Rocky. Please don't. You remember, you remember I bought those turtles from you, right? But, I yeah, I was a cuff and link. <laughs> but I mean, you know, going back, you're like, oh my god, this is ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. My son was watching it fast. with us, and he's like, "Is this guy supposed to be retarded or something?" I'm like, "No, he's wow. just a regular guy." Whoa, whoa, what? Inappropriate. Oh, man. please, come on. That comes out of your pie hole about every two seconds. Duh, this movie sucks. No, he actually kind of enjoyed the movie, but he was he was confused by the Rocky character being kind of dumb. And I go, no, he's just a regular guy. He's just kind of, you know, slow. Son, he's just Italian. <laughs> I didn't. That's inappropriate. <laughs> no, that's what you would have said. See, that's not a no, joke. No, I'm just I saying. didn't say that. You, I, um, you would have said something. I would never say that, yeah, but I'm just saying you would. No, I'm like because you know nowadays they don't. Uh, you don't. You, you don't have. <laughs> yeah. You don't have a lot of characters in movies or television who are, you know, they're not yeah. really uh, disa- You know, developmentally disabled. They just are. Yeah. You know, on the lower end of of uh, IQ area you know whoa whoa joey tribbiani but um <laughs> but i mean you don't have a lot of those you know kind of characters where he wasn't a he was just a, a guy just a guy yeah a somewhat uneducated guy who uh you know got by well, so it's great it's a great movie it's an no no it was movie. great i mean it was very uh uh, uh you know good uh Portrayal, good character. People loved them, you know. It was, it was all good. Big Rocky Fest down in St. Louis. Yeah, big Rocky Fest. So we'll see yeah. how, how long this goes on. Yeah. But uh, I'm like, sure, I'll, yeah, I'll watch. I haven't seen them all anyway. I didn't go. I don't remember going to the movies to see. I, I saw Rocky Four at the movies. That was it. That was the one with Dolph Lundgren in the whole, you know. Wait, which one was thing. Mr. T? Was that three? That was three, yeah. I didn't see any of the other ones at the theater I saw. But that Rocky's not really in my, uh, you know, I, I saw a lot of other movies. There's always, like, this stupid rumor, like, they're going to have one, like, takes place in the future where he fights his own son. <laughs> Maybe. No, I don't, I don't know. Did you hear, it? like, I don't know. I swear growing up, people had, like, these stupid, you know, like, they predict the future. Like, this is what the next one's going to be. He's going to fight his own son. Could be. I don't. Yeah, I don't remember that. But I was not in those debates that I can remember. Yeah. All the geniuses. I yeah, know, all the geniuses know. that you hung out with. Oh yeah, that. Uh, you know. Yeah. You're like, oh, he's gonna fight his own son. That's crazy. <laughs> That's the most crazy diabolical thing you can I think was, of. It's like Star Trek shit. You watching that Star Trek shit? <laughs> It's diabolical. Yeah, I got a time machine. God damn it. It's premeditated. Yeah, exactly. That's a highbrow shit there, Miles. You're thinking up. I don't know. Yeah, I thought he was going to fight his mother. Uh, you know, all that weird, you know, like uh, the, the kid from the Life commercial died. You right, know, Mikey. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Mikey. That old weird thing. Mikey started. died because he had pop rocks and soda at the same time and it exploded. Is that real? Oh, hell yeah. 
Monty Python did a whole skit about it. Yeah. With the thin mint. <laughs> With the thin mint. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no shit. Oh, my oh, goodness. Shit. Oh, my goodness. That's crazy. Oh, my goodness. Oh, but, yeah. no, anyway, I don't know. There's nothing going We're watching Rocky and eating popcorn. That's about what. That's about what's happening down here. What uh, yeah. You have some big news, apparently. Uh, you went... Uh, on, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't put it past you. I um, I have uh, this thing called acid reflux, which you hear way too much about. Like everyone what? has. It, no, basically. wait a minute. Wait. Uh, now, how many what? things do you have at this point? I mean, this you've got a plethora. Of things at this point, right. the irritable bowel. I did. I'm cured. Oh, you are? How does that get I cured? Uh, that involved a lot of stuff. Yeah, a lot of hard uh, work and a lot of finger, finger, you know, fingers bit and put up your. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> Let me just tell you, you know, around the corner where the chocolate's made. That's all I'm saying. Um, <laughs> so you got another thing? You got acid reflux now as well? With a name of, like, fingers up your butt. That's got to be good. And, uh, no, I don't know. There's this, there's this thing, and uh, it says that you can actually have your throat stretched out, Right. And, uh, Unfortunately, this was one of your lines in high school. Hey, hey, darling, you want your throat stretched out? Hey, Becky. They don't, they don't call me the throat stretcher for nothing. Hey, Babs, come here. Yeah, I think and, that this. Uh, so really, you you went in for a procedure. I went in for a procedure, and I've had it done before. What? You had it done already? Yeah, I've had it done already, but... Oh, three, four times. I just go in. I got a punch well, no, card. No, 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 no. It's, see, I had it done a long time ago, and everyone, you know, everyone's a, an expert, you know, when it comes to medical stuff, you know, on the sure. street, you know. Yeah. I know how to cure your bad knee, Bob, you know, all yeah. that, you know, crap. So everyone I talk to is like, well, you got to have it done more than once. You just can't have it done once. I'm like, oh. oh what? Okay. I'm like, oh, well, all right. Well, how, let me explain to me how this throat stretching helps you. Uh, I just I have some problems with my throat. Uh huh. And uh, just because your dad said you had a smart mouth doesn't mean you have problems. Uh, yeah, it's uh, it's uh, it's not it's it's weird. I don't know. I want to go into it. But weird, I don't so. know how such a dumbass can have such a smart mouth. And. <laughs> yeah. No, I've never been accused of that. No. Mm, okay. And uh, anyway, uh, so like the guy that I went to originally, he has retired, and oh. I've got like the more like serious looking like Steve Martin doctor now. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're gonna have to stretch your throat, <laughs> Doctor Hoffer. Uh, yeah. No. Ha- 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 <laughs> No, but no, I mean, I don't know the guy, you know, just, he's very serious. You know, he's like, all right, well, we're going to do this. And we're going to have to put it off for a little while, but we're going to do it. I'm like, all right. And it, the time had come, and uh, I'm like, okay. And I was very keyed up. I was super. You you're, you're not going to be able to use this Groupon in another week. I'm just telling you. You'll never eat Sherbert again. Miles. Uh, let's it's see. Off. I got uh, the anal dilation or the throat stretching. Uh, I got to use yeah. it before next month. <laughs> Yeah, you know, and then, you know, you've got to, like, pre-register, so, you know, you got to talk to the nurse on the phone, you know, it's like, you know, have you uh, ever smoked marijuana? What? Why would they care? Um, uh, no, no. Alcohol? No. <laughs> Don't believe it. And uh, I, I hope these aren't really relevant medical questions, because you probably lied about all of them. 
Have you touched yourself in the last 30 days? Like, no, 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 no. Not right. that I recall. I mean, maybe brushed up <laughs> against it accidentally while I was standing outside the women's restroom. But uh... Yeah, yeah, that do not count, right? I mean, come on. No, come on. No, I don't know. They go through your meds and all this crap. And blah, blah. Yeah. And uh, so it's like, all right, well, you know, show up, show up, and, you know. Oh. All right, so I wear my sweatpants, which your family hates. I wore my sweatpants. <laughs> uh-huh. And uh, actually, this is the third time I've had this done. Now that I think about it, holy shit! Oh, okay. And uh, anywho, um, uh, I got there, and they, you know, well, you're gonna have to take off that sexy shirt, sir, and put on the gown. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> that yeah. sexy shirt. You're gonna have to take off your crop top. My my <laughs> Ocean Pacific shirt. I'll take it off with. <laughs> You want, you know. Mm-hmm. We take off my members only jacket first and then my ocean um, specific. Dr. Holmes will be with you momentarily. He's uh working <laughs> <laughs> He's getting himself and worked up into a frenzy for this throat stretching exercise you're gonna be doing. He's just going crazy, man. Yeah. Mm. And uh, you know, it's one of those hurry up and wait things like, Okay, well it's we're we're probably gonna do it. You know, soon, but there's like 12 people ahead of you. I'm like, oh, okay. Right. You got a lot of throats to stretch today, sir. Yeah, I go, well, at least it ain't my bunghole, you know, yeah. so. I don't uh, know that we can have throat stretching as our title because uh, I'm afraid it'll, it'll set off the Google <laughs> alarms. <laughs> and uh, and uh, so, you know, you got to get an IV and all this crap. and uh-huh. I finally get wheeled in to the ER, I guess. I don't know what you want to call it. So the, it's to weird. the uh, throat stretching theater. Yes, which is weird because you're almost going to like one of these weird blast doors you see like in these like nuclear movies. Yeah. You know, like these weird mm-hmm. Get smart door. You, know, and then, I mean, da, you da, see da. this banner. Welcome yeah. to the Four Loco Operating Arena. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Red Bull. And a minute, and there, it's always like you've, a million times. Okay, what's your name again? What's your birth date, sir? Yeah. You know why you're here? <laughs> uh, so apparently they do know you. Okay. I don't know. I mean, they're. They, I think they're just so scared. Like they've got the wrong guy. Like are you yeah, sure? Uh, you uh, uh, I don't know. I was going uh, to uh, I got this stuff, acid reflux or something. I don't know. I'm like a Balboa. That's right. Uh. And, uh, next, so I'm like, well, I'm just gonna pay attention to see when they actually knock me out because I never really remember that when that happens. You know? Right. And, I hope I you're knocked out for this throat stretching exercise. Yeah, you get. Yeah, your ass gets knocked out because I yeah. got fucking knocked out. Because they're like, you. well, here's. I thought, okay, this is where it got really weird because like well, we're gonna put this plastic thing in your mouth and you're gonna bite down. Hard. Hard. This is, it's a whistle. <laughs> I found like, you know, Ving Reams and uh, Frick yeah, and yeah. uh, <laughs> uh, Tito yeah. uh, movies. Marsalis. Yeah, like, You're doing a Marsalis here? Oh, my. Yeah, man. like, what the fuck is it? <laughs> I've never been in an operating room where you get bent over a big log. Yeah, like, well, uh, turn on your left side, bite down on this. Uh-huh. No, yeah. this, sir, not that, yeah, this. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, sir. Okay, I can do that. And uh, I wake uh, up. I feel a tickle in my bum. Room. What's going on down there? Ah, two my for boy. one special. I feel a little swampy where I shouldn't, you know. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Uh, no, I wake up back in the room where I originally started, and... They're like, oh, we'll bring you a drink or something. You know, like, okay. Right. Then, yeah. We stretched uh, that throat good. Mm. Yeah. I'm like, can you get me my phone, please? <laughs> Why? And then that's when all the druggy, uh, I think I've only, I only texted three people today. I'm not sure. It was weird. It was just like, I don't remember sending it to you. I'm like, Is that what? Oh, you didn't, you don't remember sending me the, I did not really no. Pictures? I'm, like, uh, hmm. I'm like, I think I did. Yeah. Well I'm glad you Yours didn't do like any three. tasteful nudes or anything. Yeah. Well, here's my balls. <laughs> and uh Well the name like balls, it's gotta be good. 
They were stretching and, my throat, and I was stretching other things. Yes, I was trying to like send one to my son because he was my ride, you know. And I yeah, I think it was I was trying to write the word ready, but I instead I wrote like resist or something. I'm like resist. <laughs> He's like, Dad, I think you mean ready, so I'm gonna come to the hospital and get you. So I'm like, okay. Yeah. But uh-huh. the one I said to my wife was the worst. It was like Gazaba the Bab You know she's like, I don't know. like I'm scatting texting. Yeah. I'm like, what the f-? I don't even remember saying it to her. I'm like, what the fuck? She's like uh, honey, take off the Jack Black filter off of your phone texting. Thank you. Yeah. So, because like on yours, I think I wrote Purple Haze, like the old. Jimmy you did. Haze. You wrote Purple Haze, and I'm like, I don't know what the fuck he's talking about. I'm assuming at this yeah. point that you basically got your nut caught in the zipper or something. I don't know. So I tried to like put that on hers too, apparently, but I wrote Purple Hakes. Purple Hakes? Okay. Purple Hakes. Purple yeah. Haze. Why would you do purple? What was Purple Haze for? You know, no, you know, uh, acting funny, but I don't know why. Oh, okay, I got you. Excuse you me. Know, purple is, Haze uh, is about drugs. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got you. Purple got you. Haze. I know, but you sent me two pictures as well, and yeah. none of, neither one of them had anything purple in them. And then no, you, you misspelled pants. You go, look at yeah. my sweat. Pazuta. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm like, I was a little effed up. I'm gonna I'm be like, honest. With you. I'm like, what the? And then I, didn't, I did not get it for quite some time. And later in the day, and I'm like, this came earlier in the day, and I had not checked anything because I was busy. And I'm like, what the fuck? What the? F-? I'm like, well, it doesn't look like he's been in an accident, but. Um, uh, I assumed you just collapsed at work or something. <laughs> it's my uh, polyorchidism. <laughs> I figured you collapsed at work and they took you into the hospital. That's what I figured. Yeah. Well, he's had a stroke. There you go. Yep. Yeah, I didn't even know I was texting everyone. I'm like, what? Mm-hmm. <laughs> what? That's interesting. I didn't. Give me that phone. Give me a phone. I'm gonna... I got to take I'm a dick see. pic. <laughs> Picture the president, very president, Bibba. Bibba, Shabba, the Bibba. Yeah. Oh wow. I'm surprised so, they gave you your phone, to be honest. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I think they might have, you know, because they don't want you to drive. Definitely not drive. Like right. maybe you shouldn't drive. But, and maybe you shouldn't text either. I'm thinking. Yeah, maybe <laughs> not. So I don't even know what I've sent my boss. I'm hoping I didn't send him anything. <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> Let's, like, let's see what this fat fuck's gonna type into this phone right now. A little monkey on his phone here. Huh? How strange. So, how's your throat feel? Ah, uh, like I can take on something big. <laughs> <laughs> on a scale from one to ten. Yeah. Well, that's great. So, do you feel? I mean, I didn't realize that you uh, suffered so greatly with this acid reflux. To be honest with you, no, no, I, was, no, I was just I think it's I'm always like if you listen to the show at all, I'm always like constantly clearing my throat all the time. And yeah, I thought that had to do with your extracurricular activities. Nah, that, yeah, you wish, but yeah, <laughs> you wish, <laughs> you wish. You wish. <sighs> I don't know why. I just figured, uh, you know, he's got some kind of problem. No, well, I, I got problems. Yeah. I told you this. I told you the story about the guy that I used to work with who uh, would uh, rub holes in his pants because he kept touching his dick. <laughs> <laughs> Please let it be Mark. Please let it be Mark. No, no, Please no. Let it be Mark. This is a whole other guy. Did I never tell you about this guy? Oh. I think that's a story for another day. But yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Oh no, I was. He had a nervous tick. I mean, yeah. I'm serious. This is a literal. This is literally the truth here. So he had this nervous tick where he always was checking himself. Yeah. And he he would he would do it so often. I mean, he was. It was so mm-hmm. bad that he would literally rub his pants away 
right there in that spot on his penis. He was yeah. a nice guy, but God damn, he was so ticky. This wasn't your brother, was it? No, it wasn't my brother. No. He doesn't have any any ticks like that that I'm aware of. But uh, <laughs> but no, I mean, he actually had patches on his pants. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> yeah, I mean, he was a really nice guy, but... Uh, he was he he like was so nervous and twitchy and he constantly would you know you know one two one two one two you, you got me a cd for my birthday what is it oh the divinals huh the divinals yeah oh yeah really funny i touched myself huh touched that's real myself. funny ha ha the the weird thing was you know during and you know, I have no idea what he looks like now, but at the time when he was young, he was, you know, considered a pretty good looking guy and he, you know, uh, did really well with the ladies, but I guess they never questioned the whole, you know. Hey, um, Francis, I just wanted to ask a question. Uh, why, uh, yeah. why is this thing? Maybe like he had more different pants when he went out. I don't it, special pants that had like reinforcement or something but what's up with your jordash what's up with that but yeah he would do a ball check like every two seconds i swear to god Jeez. yeah that, there's that's one of your you know that's one of those characters yeah. for the movies you know jimmy two balls or whatever i don't know yeah. but he was a nice yeah. enough guy i don't know what i don't know what happened to him <laughs> Yeah, I should look him up. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I don't no. want to know. <laughs> no, you don't want to know. I don't think you want to know. Yeah, but anyway, I mean, he probably could help you stretch your throat. Yeah. So you're gonna be? I mean, what's the next steps on all this? What do you mean? I mean, what do you gotta do now? I mean, what's you gotta do? Like exercises? You gotta go me 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 me. What do you gotta do? Oh, yeah, I put swords down my throat and stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> I, no, I don't know. I don't, if I was given instructions, I don't know what the fuck they were. I was just like, well, huh? Do they stick a appliance down your throat for this? Or what's the... I don't understand. I don't know. Saying. I had to bite on this plastic green thing with a hole in the metal. I'm like, uh-oh. They blow you up like a balloon or what? You know? I, I don't know. I was not even No one even I gave you even... like... You know, uh, Mr. Title here, I'm going to give you, these are some pictograms to show you what's going to happen to your throat. Ah, I feel like Bob Robert. When I had uh, my, uh, the guy was doing my ear, he had a whole ear model. He showed me all kinds of shit. No. Hmm. No. I was having ear, my ear problems. Yeah. Yeah. How strange. Well. I, yeah. hope, I, I didn't notice that you cleared your throat tonight, so I mean that's good. Yeah, oh well, yeah, yeah. yeah it was you a good time sound like me. goddamn phlegm factory all the time. I know. Yeah, I might tell you off the phone. I'll be like, yeah, uh. it's like got some kind of folds in there in your throat, catching all this snot or something. Yeah, all the fat. All the fat. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Title, I'm sorry you have fat throat syndrome. We're going to have to do some liposuction on your throat. It's like ling rings on a tree. Yeah. I don't know what the hell's going on with that. Well, I'm glad you're... I, I was worried that it was worse than that, to be honest. So. Yeah. I'm glad it's not. I'm glad it was uh, elective surgery um, yeah. for you to further your career in the gay porn industry. Thank you. <laughs> 